Okay, so I'm gonna put you on YouTube doing this work, Bailey. Oh, okay. And uh, everybody in the YouTube community is gonna judge your worth as a person by how far along you get today, right, okay? I have my uh, muscle man strength going on then. <laughs> A lot of vines here. It's a lot of vines. That's pretty impressive. Getting it all out of there in one go. How about some help? Sure. So I don't think I want to run. Hey, bud. Where are you going? Uh, I don't think I want to run 500 feet of extension cable to get out here where I can cut. So we have this battery pack that we can plug this sawzall into. But I don't know why your dad has the uh, metal cutting blade on it. We need the wood cutting blade. Uh, two steps back, one step forward. Okay. I guess should work a little better. Okay, so you see this you see this collar here? Bailey? Yeah. I'm gonna pull push that down and then you can pull this blade out. You see the collar? Press the collar in. Or turn it. I'm not sure if it's yeah, I guess it's turn. Yeah. So when you got it now you can pull it out. Oh. You have to do the same thing to get it in. Yep. Uh, you gonna cut upwards? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. All right. Okay, let go of it. Oh, no, you didn't quite get it. Uh oh. Turn it, push it in, nothing happens. Here, take this. All right. We gotta really pull that all the way over to open it up so it'll accept it. Then you let go of it. Okay. All right. In the master. I thought it was your job to charge the charger, bud. Uh, I forgot about it. <laughs> Fell asleep. That's what he's good at, falling asleep. Well, sometimes things don't turn out the way you want. I came to uh, get some work done, and uh, the battery charger is not charged, and so I thought, well, okay, we'll put walls on the trailer so we can start taking all of this stuff to the dump. Uh, the trailer's not there, so. <sighs> now we're gonna drive out of town, go get the trailer, and get everything ready so that we can get a uh, start bright and early tomorrow and uh, get something accomplished, so. So that's what happens in just a few months. <laughs> so, uh Time to get busy. Good job. 18 inches. That was a good job, bud. <laughs> Wait, what? I didn't see the pile earlier. <laughs> yeah, you know. Alright. Okay, I want you to make another pile just like that and make it right there. Uh, Bailey? Yeah. Uh, you might want to take the strap off. <laughs> there you go, bud. Sure is hard work filming, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let me give you a hand. Too 
much. Yeah. I didn't realize it was that short. I'm sorry. Here you go. How do you want me to go? A little bit that way? Huh? A little bit kind of that way, yeah? I'm just worried about hitting the side of your trailer. I'll just go super slow. Yeah, can you tell me when the chain's gonna be tall? Okay. All right, it's all the way stretched out. It's fully off. You did it, Chris. <laughs> I didn't do it. Oh, I gotta back up or I can get that chain off. That's good. Well, Bailey, that was mighty neighborly of you to do that. Thank you, Gordon. <laughs> well, Bailey, that looks much better. Good job. Yeah. So, High what? High five. High five. So, uh, you have been weighed and you have been measured and you have not been found wanting. So, okay. First drop in the bucket, you ready for round two? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. All right. That's enough for today. Gordon? Hmm? We're going to go mow. Well, I'm going to go mow. You're going to go mow? Do you think you can uh, back this lawnmower out without putting a scratch in or cherry paint job? Well, I usually do, so yeah, I think I can. <laughs> Let me get the gas. Yeah, that'd be a good idea, bud. That'd be a good idea. <laughs> okay, you want to... Be sure and leave a little bit in the bottom of the can so that if you run out of gas, you have enough to, you know, start it up and get it back up on the trailer. So okay. don't pour it all in. I think there's more in the can than will fit in the mower. Now we just wait. I'm gonna lower the gate and we're gonna watch you back, try to back out. All righty. I have this sneaking suspicion that uh, these environmental contraptions on these gas cans to save the environment uh, end up causing more gas on the ground <laughs> than just a regular gas can without, without those devices.
so I think I've said before on this channel that uh, when you're bouncing back and forth between living somewhere else and trying to do this, uh, things get pretty scruffy pretty quick in the summertime. And this lot looks horrible. So I've got him on the mower and then we're gonna try to do something about that. So we'll see how he does. Got all the, most of the front yard mowed and radiated. Got the side of the building. Okay. Got a bit more over here to go and then I got to the backyard. What fun. All right, well, no passing out. Not on my shift. Thank you. All right, so he just told me that it's all done and it looks perfect. It's not perfect. I need to finish up. Oh, oh, now you're backing down. Huh? You said it was perfect looking. I never said that. <laughs> need to finish up weed eating tomorrow. No. The weed eating tomorrow? What about weed eating today? I'm too tired. <laughs> need to food me. I got to remember that next time. I want to quit work and go home. I had enough. I'll just say, I'm too tired. <laughs> Do it tomorrow. <laughs> In the words of Joe Dirt, dang, that looks good, boy. <laughs> he ran to start the mower back up because it's almost perfect. So now with punctuated pushes, I can hit that and then that and that. And uh, yeah, this place will be squared away once again. Okay, good job, man. All right, now it's all done. Yeah, now I'm tired. So now we can really go. So, all right, thanks guys. Uh, I'll see you again next time.